Welcome back guys, two minute reviews, Mo and Solly, two minute talking. Suntory Toki, blended Toki, blended whiskey. Tell me about it though. It's blended with grain and a single malt, Hakushu and Cheetah. And Yamazaki, so it's a yeah. blend of the three Main Suntory distillery. distilleries. Yamazaki, the oldest distillery in Japan? I believe so. Hakushu? Yeah. And Cheetah. Cheetah, which is a grain distillery. Yeah, so we're looking for something in this that's going to be was a blend smoother than anything, anything else really, isn't it? Smoother than anything, anything else. I said it twice. Um, so obviously it's got a lovely color on it, hasn't it? It's, it's uh, quite pale. It's very pale, very golden and honey looking. It looks like it might be tasty. Uh, I like the symbolism behind most of Japanese whiskey. So the whole Toki thing behind it is quite intriguing. The bottle, you know. Great branding. Everyone knows I love a bit of simple branding. Japanese do it best. Simplicity is best. So obviously we've done a couple of Japanese whiskeys. Japanese, Japanese whiskey? Japanese whiskies before. What uh, was that? The Nikka and the Nikka coffee malt is one we like. Coffee malt, one of my favourites. Love it. Look for the review down there. Here? Maybe. Over Maybe here? Okay. There? Yeah. Everywhere. <laughs> now, we are keeping to uh, the new tradition of keeping things within a two minute time two frame. Two minute review. We're literally just going to go into this and see what comes from it. But uh, have you got any other thing, anything else you want to say about it? I love Japanese whiskey. Make it Suntory time. Nice, and I do too. <laughs> I'm excited to see because this is probably one of the cheapest ones you can get out there in the market. Yeah. So it's about 30 pounds. Um, it's a blend. A lot of Japanese whiskies are blends, yeah. to be fair. Heard good things, uh, looking forward to trying it. Yeah, should be good. It looks nice, let's go for it. Two minute review, two Ooh. minute review. Ooh. Ooh. Oh God, the bottle's like a fabric, the cap for it. And it just teared away, that's, that's not ideal. To teared away or tore away? Comment below. Screw top, slightly lets it down. I was about to get some and put it in my hair. Yes, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, it is very, very clear, isn't it? Very clear. Very clear. So, as you guys know, two minutes, no cuts, no edits. You know the score. Bring Alper in and let's make that shit official. Two minutes, maybe. Suntory Tokyo. Kampai. Kampai. Ooh. Right off the bat, and I, this is what I expected. I think maybe I had a preconception from the colour, but I thought it was going to be quite light. It is very light. Reminds me of a grassy knoll. Nice bit, nice bit of honey there. A grassy knoll. <laughs> yeah. yeah, there is a nice bit of honey in there. What? Is it? Is it like? Why am I thinking of grass-fed cows? Is that because I just talked about hemp? Yeah. <laughs> I'm thinking about mint more than anything. Yeah, there's definitely some mint in there. It's very, very light. Yeah. It's, it, the, the nose is quite light and fresh and something it's you herby. don't normally relate to whiskeys. Like. Yeah, it's quite herby. Let's do this. Let's go. Hmm. Ooh, green apple. The mouth feels very nice. Definitely green apple. Yeah. The mouth feels nice. More lightness, green, airy, fresh, herbs. Definitely. I'm getting a bit of a licorice there as well. That's more in the finish, I think. Yeah. Well, I only got it in the finish anyway. No, oh, it's coming through, definitely. Oh, it's not bad. What do you it's... think of the finish? The finish lacks, I think. It's, it's gone. Yeah. Nothing there. Mm. Quite a dry feel. Slightly peppery on the finish, but short. Short, peppery finish. Short, peppery finish. <laughs> That's a good way to describe it. No, it's really smooth. Uh, you know, really, you know, for grain and single malt blend. It's not bad. I can see why people enjoy it. But, uh, it's a bit zesty as well. Yeah. There's a bit of like citrus in there. Like a grapefruit. Yeah. S specifically. It's because it's quite dry. Specifically. 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 Yeah, it's, really, it's very light and uh, citrusy. Grassy, light, citrusy. Oh, oh shit, that's quite quick. Oh god. That's what she said. All right, so we're doing this after the count of three. Oh, he's still drinking. Was I allowed to do that? Am I allowed yeah. to do that? Do whatever you want. Okay, cool. Craft whiskey, boys. Three, two, one, seven point four. Oh my god! Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> 
No way. It is a 7.4. No way. Holy crap. Can I rescore 7.2? We're zen. That's beautiful. No way. Yeah, all right, cool. So it's very easy drinking. Really easy, very affordable, you know, something you can purchase, you know, quite quite accessible in most supermarkets, enjoyable. It's got real nice distinctive flavours in there. I think, um, like you said, the mouthfeel is quite nice. Um, real kind of citrusy tones to it. On the nose, it wasn't really kind of emphatic, nothing really bold about it at all. Although there was a bit of honey there. And even now, actually on the finish, I'm getting a bit of oakiness. Yeah, well, nice. actually I say yes, but I, I'm not getting You're it. You're not getting it? Nah, I'm getting it. Yeah, this kind of reminds me of my, uh, my mother. Okay. Light, airy, likes herbs and that. This is herby, she likes herbs, all that sort of stuff. Basil, that's it. That's the Basil. fucking thing I'm thinking of. Um, but yeah, no, it's nice. It's a very easy to drink blend from Japan. So yeah, I think it's well deserving of a 7.4. Yeah. Not I personally too. probably wouldn't search this out or, you know, go and buy it because there's way more ahead of it in the list, but it's a decent dram. And talking of Japanese, we've got some really exciting ones on the way. We do have some very nice Japanese whiskeys to When they arrive. they arrive. And you know we do like our Japanese. And we're obviously saving them for when Jay can grace us with his presence once more. Where is Jay, actually? God knows, somewhere or another. Doing his Cut own. to Jay doing something sick. <laughs> nah, come back to us, having <laughs> a better time and drinking whiskey. No, it is, it's not been a bad whiskey to review at all. Uh, Suntory whiskey. Toki going up at a 7.4. But anyway, that's uh, us with the Toki two minutes review. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. I know a lot of you love Japanese whiskey. You're gonna be, you know, probably annoyed we drank this and reviewed it, but tell you what, send us some better recommendations. We wanna find what. a nine point Japanese whiskey, please. So if you wouldn't mind, comment below and help us. Yeah, and if you don't, well, you know what happens. Not a lot. <laughs> Someone else will suggest it and we'll do something else. Boom! It's Craft Whiskey Boys. Thank you very much for watching. We're out. Have a bite.